Although it might look like a regular day here at Tosa West, it had a different feeling. Underneath the regular curriculum, students and staff were remembering 9-11. I do. I was actually a business ed teacher at Longfellow Middle School. And I was actually on one of my prep periods. And I was walking past the teacher's lounge. And I heard people going, oh my God, oh my God. And uh, walked in and started watching um, what was happening in New York in daycare when it happened but I remember when I first heard about it I was sitting in my living room with my dad and I was watching it on TV and I really didn't know what was going on I really like couldn't comprehend uh, it, it's interesting that we're in this room because I, I was in this room when I, I heard about it uh, students were talking about a, an airplane that crashed into a building in New York and so at first I thought oh okay it was just some random pilot of a private plane or something like that and then a little more information came out and uh, I turned on a TV and we could we could see the actual plane going into one of the, the towers in New York and because a lot of the students are not old enough to remember it some classes had activities to learn about 9-11 oh yeah we uh, interviewed um, like a family member or somebody that was old enough and could understand what happened because like I was one and a half or something like that and in this process many students came to develop their own opinions on 9-11 and have a better understanding on the subject and like I think it's just sad and like to think about why was it and why would this happen and how like why people I think that I guess other like con continents and countries I guess think, oh, we're in North America, we can just do whatever we want to them, and they wouldn't even care. But beyond classes and individuals, 9-11 now has its own tradition at West. Um, thank goodness Mr. Kepke has been very vocal since he's been here at West, and he always comes down and, and makes an announcement. Reporting for West Side Stories, this is Yara Zabihi.